Hey YouTubers, welcome back. It's been a little while. I've had a busy summer painting cottages outdoors on all three of the big lakes here in Muskoka. So I thought I'd just uh, give you a treat for those in different parts of the world. At the moment I'm on Lake Joe, so I'll give you a scan of the bay we're in. And then I'll show you a couple more of the projects I've been working on. Main cottage up in the distance there, in the background. And we're just in the middle of an exterior paint of this cute little boathouse. You can see we've just uh, been painting under that stairwell. And the rest is a little spotted up, but it's ready to go. So that's just a project we've been working on on Lake Joe. I'll show you some other. Fair to leave the location without showing you the finished look of the siding. So here comes into view the boathouse we've been working on. You can see now that it's all solid. So now I'll show you the name. Lake Joe's neighbor to the east, Lake Rosso. And again we had another boathouse exterior to stain. We went from black to a very dark brown color. So let's check it out. So this is the approach to the boathouse from the pathway from the main cottage. You can see that it's a two-story but it's a single slip boathouse. It has a little uh, residence on the top level. A covered porch there. We had to power wash it all down, dust off a million cobwebs. But generally it was in pretty good shape. And restained it. So as I promised, I give you a, a look of the scenery from my office. So there's a close-up of the boathouse. And as we look out onto the lake, you can see a few other cottages in the distance. And this is really the Muskoka painter's view from the office, if you will. Every day. Working in these conditions, can't complain. Shot of the flowers. It's more to do with the uh, gardening done by the owners, There's some landscaping there. So on to the next one. And so now we come to the big daddy of all the three lakes, that's Lake Muskoka. I'm going to show you the biggest job that I've worked on this spring summer season. And it's a full cottage inside and outside. A brand new two-car garage, a renovated boathouse, and a slipless boathouse on a dock. So let's do the tour. This is the uh, two-car garage. It was a completely new build placed on the property on a very large driveway. Then we come to the main cottage. And they said it was a new build, it was actually about a 90% renovation. The entire roof was replaced, the top level was renovated, and the bottom half renovated. So now we're standing at the lake side of the cottage, off of the sun room, or Muskoka room as it's more commonly known here in this part of the world. And that's the view from the sun room. And we'll just move across the lake side of the cottage and we'll go up on the lakeside deck and we'll have a look around have a scan of the scenery see what you think
and we'll just take a scan of the lakeside view of the cottage as you're approaching. Cottage, dockside, you're approached by boat. I'm standing on the end of the dock and then here we have this slipless boathouse it's called. It's basically an extension of the dock with a gazebo on it. This one's completely open but we can close them in. You can see that with the stain is continued right throughout the theme of the property it has this dark gray stain and then it has the white stain to highlight the trim and the detail. Last but not least we have the boathouse. It has a two-slip boathouse and there's a little living quarters upstairs completely self-sufficient for guests and what have you. And I'll give you another shot of the boathouse as you approach the property. As promised I'd show you the view approaching the property driveway and there's the boathouse. As you can imagine that's kept us very busy for three or four months painting all these properties. If you enjoyed that overview of the properties I've been working on this spring and summer season and I just want to give a shout out to all my loyal YouTube subscribers and uh, just to express my appreciation and look out for some new how-to videos coming your way shortly and hope you find them handy as always and we'll see you soon